Before we continue programming using the feature control frame data, let me show you a new function called the clearance cube. The clearance cube command has its own toolbar and we'll just drag it off of the docking area for a moment. And to use this command, what we're going to do, first of all, is select clearance cube definition. And this is very similar to the clearance plane command that we had in previous versions of PCDMS. However, the beauty of this command is it's going to create a safety zone around the entire part. So I'm going to start off by choosing an offset value. And we'll give it a distance of, say, 30 millimeters. The next thing that I'm going to do is place a check next to the option Activate Clearance Cube Motion. The third thing I'm going to do is display the clearance cube. And we can see inside the graphics display window, PCDMIS draws a cube around our part. And this cube represents the safety zone the probe will drive to before measuring any features. And this is a global switch. And when we turn this on, PCDMIS is going to take any new measured features and automatically apply the clearance cube command to it. Now, unlike the clearance plane command, we're not going to see an extra line of code inside of our edit window. Instead, to control which features use the clearance cube and which features don't use the clearance cube, we need to go under the advanced dialog and we need to select status. And the status window shows us all the features in our part program and whether that feature will use the clearance cube or not. Now, for our planes 2 through plane 6, which represents datums A, B, and C, we can see the clearance cube is not active. To activate it, all I need to do is select all of these features, right mouse button click on the active column, and from the pop-up menu, choose On. Now these features are included in the features that will use the clearance cube. The constraints dialog tells PCDMIS which directions to apply the clearance cube in. By default, we've disabled the Z minimum direction because PCDMIS knows if the part is sitting on a fixture not to drive clear in the Z minus direction.